are tuned in for a brand new episode of Reality Rap. Now let's get this thing started with a brand new episode of Marriage Bootcamp Reality Stars. This week's Meltdown Moment, ooh, it was juicy, like it was good TV, but at the same time, I don't know what the hell just happened, but like I said, it's terrible f bitch. I'm not afraid of you. You wanna start a fight? No. I'm not scared of you. No, I'm not going to go there. To I'm not gonna do it. And I don't wanna fight with you. I'm really a fan. Stupid. Why would I wanna fight don't with you? Don't be my fan. Be my friend. Don't even be my friend. Be in the house. Holy <laughs> Okay, done. Just be in this house. Like, bitch, you not even on my level. Terry really couldn't talk to me like that. Okay, Lorenzo, you're like one of my favorites on the show, but bro, you are in the dog house. I thought Bruce was gonna whoop your ass. We were all waiting like, was it four times he cheated, or was it with four different women? I don't know what the better answer is. How many females, Lorenzo? How many? More than one? More than two? Four. Four times or four different women? Which one is it? Four different women. Four different women. Four women means you're just like totally not happy with British. Her hand was just, it was, it was on reserve. It was like a countdown. Five, four, three. <laughs> you better not say the wrong thing by the time I get the one. Like, it was that intense. So this week, Jim and Elizabeth gave the couple shock collars. Yes, it wasn't even used for anything sexual. It was whenever you made somebody mad, zzz, let me zap your ass, zzz. Remember when you hit the toilet seat down, zzz. Remember when you drank the last of the Kool-Aid, you get my point. They can zap each other for anything. I hated that your mailbox is always wait, wait, full. Wait, wait, wait. Ow. <laughs> I hate it when you don't even return my texts. Stop it. <laughs> oh, up. I don't know how I would have felt on the second part of the activity. Basically, the couples had to get in the water and be a team on a canoe. They were smart about it. They put the person who's controlling as a blindfolded person who had to row, and the least dominant person as like the person who was giving the instructions of where to go and how to do the activity. Clearly, British and Lorenzo lost. Lorenzo and British pulled <laughs> up in last place. I think they were literally feet away from the finish line and still gave up. Can we be done? Because I'm, I'm, I'm over. Like, right, you gonna be done, you gonna be done. Who giving horrible instructions? Oh my God. Problem is you don't listen. I was listening. That you, you were giving very bad directions, trust me. Okay guys, let's go. Like I said, this is going on for three weeks straight. Cody is in it to win it. Him and Michelle won the challenge. And I think this is good. Maybe they can have champion sex, like, champion sex, like, sweaty, fresh off the challenge, take my microphone back off. Let me just get it in real quick before we take a shower. Champion sex, like, listen, Cody, Michelle, if y'all did a sex tape, I'm first in line. I'm buying like seven copies, one for each day of the week. I can't judge these couples, but I know somebody who can. When you get into the habit of being angry and the habit of being loud, it's very hard to break. Usually you can't do it that quickly. It's like I was in a better mood today. I just want to apologize in front of y'all to my wife. I don't talk to my wife like that, and I'm so sorry that I did that yesterday. It's like it was just those little things when she do them, it's like, I'm good. Okay, guys, that's been a brand new episode of Reality Wrap. Of course, the conversation doesn't have to end here. Use the hashtag MarriageBootCamp.